Yu-Gi-Oh! 101 card review, hit a review of card coming in, Crystal, uh, Clash of Rebellions, almost slipped up, Clash of Rebellions, <clears throat> April 25th, OCG, August 7th, TCG, this is Crystal Rose, it's a light rock effect monster, level 2, attack defense 500, description, once per turn you can send one Gem Knight or Melodious monster from your hand or deck to the graveyard and if you do this card's name becomes the sent monsters until the end phase if this card is in your graveyard you can banish one fusion monster from your graveyard special summon this card in defense position you can only use this effect of crystal rose once per turn so crystal rose is a it's basically a card that it, you know I mean that's kind of interesting considering that you know, this is supporting both the Gym Knights and the Melodious Archetypes. And, you know, with with both of them being Fusion Archetypes, I, th I just think it's interesting. So I wonder if the Gym Knights and the Melodious Monsters are going to have a monster where you can fuse a Gym Knight and a Melodious Monster together and make a, like a Fusion Monster from that. So that's going to be interesting. I think, you know, that could be coming. And... You know, I haven't. If they confirmed it already, I haven't seen the card yet. And if not, then I think they're going to confirm it. And maybe in like the next booster pack or so. Maybe the next one after that. Maybe the next booster pack after the next one. I don't know, but I feel like it's coming. Like a, a fusion monster between the Gym Knights and the Melodious. Now, this card coincidentally is not a, a part of the Crystal Ar uh, Archetype. Even though there's like very few crystal cards, like this isn't a part of the crystal archetype because the original Japanese name, uh, um, it, it doesn't have like the wording in the original Japanese name uh, to be a part of the crystal rose. Uh, uh, excuse me, to be a part of the crystal archetype. It's funny how that works, but but yeah, that's the that's just the way it is. So. It's a rock, so you can use rock bombardment if you care to. I don't see why you would, considering that this is, is supposed to be a substitute somewhat um, to fuse a Gym Knight or a Melodious Monster. To fuse into a Gym Knight or a Melodious Monster. And then on top of that, it's resourceful. So, if... I don't think they have any, but if it's a dark monster in like your graveyard, or even if you use cards like uh, different dimension reincarnation, you know you'll be able to special summon that fusion monster back from your banish zone after you use this card's effect to get it back on the field. So that would be uh, helpful. So this is a very resourceful card for those archetypes. Um, that way you can just have you know monsters that you, well, that way you can have the monster that you need for whatever fusion that you're trying to do so it's it's very um very helpful so with it being a rock monster and being a light monster this is good well i would say it's it's better for the gym knights at least for the time being until the melodious gets um, I would say some trap card, get some uh, some fusion monsters that need like a light monster uh, sp uh, specifically <clears throat> if they don't already have it. But for the gym knights, um, you know they have a fusion monster that needs a light monster. I can't remember the name of it. I think it was Seraphonite. Well, you need one Gym Knight monster and one Light monster. Like, this, since it goes... Since it's meant to be used by the Gym Knights, I think this is a good card. Like, it's pretty much perfect for it, because not only do you get to search out... um, Not only do you get to dump a Gym Knight and it copies the name of it, you can also use it, since it's a Light monster, and, well, and it's a Rock you know, if, if I'm not mistaken, there's a, 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 a Gym Knight monster that needs a Rock-type monster to fuse with it, uh, with another Gym Knight in order to create it. So, this just works so well with the Gym Knights. You know, it's very helpful. And with the Melodious, I don't know how good it is going to be, but outside of, the, you know, just being helpful with the fusions, 
Um, I don't know what else they got going on because I never played the archetype really, so I couldn't I couldn't tell you. But I, I can see where it it can be helpful in the melodious uh, archetype. So link to this card is going to be in the description. You guys can check it out, and I'll see you for the next card review. Peace.